a video about landfills. 4.4 pounds. Sounds pretty small, right? It's about the weight of a 2 liter bottle of soda, an average sized chihuahua, or an ostrich egg. It's also the amount of trash that the average American throws out each day. Multiply that by 365 days a year and over 300 million Americans and you get 167 tons of trash each year. But where does it all go? Where does one store the equivalent of 76 billion chihuahuas? The answer for most of our trash is landfills. A landfill is a structure dug into the earth that is designed to keep trash from contacting groundwater, rainwater, and air. The landfill is first lined with rubber or clay to keep in pollutants. Then, a system of pipes is placed to collect leachate, the contaminated liquid which drains from trash when it is wet. The incoming trash is compacted by machines and placed into layers of the landfill called cells. These cells are stacked on top of one another with soil in between until the landfill has reached capacity. Then a lid is placed on top to seal it. Over the course of thousands of years, bacteria will slowly decompose the trash in this oxygen-free environment, producing methane, a highly flammable greenhouse gas. What happens to the trash in a sealed landfill? Not much. Unlike composted or recycled trash, it will not be broken down or given new life. While excavating 40-year-old landfills, researchers have found newspapers which are just as legible as the day they were buried. Plastic bottles from the beverages we drink for only a few minutes will stay intact for 450 years. The 4.4 pounds of trash we throw out today will be the same as we left them for hundreds to thousands of years. For this reason, we should divert trash from landfills by reducing, reusing, composting, and recycling.